Hello, it's uh, Dr. Bove, aka Captain Crunch. Today we are adjusting Erica. She's been a, a, an amazing patient for many years now, since uh, she was a college student and uh, managing uh, a local retail store. Uh, she's always been a go-getter, a uh, college athlete, and uh, you know, because of all that activity and work, a lot of tension and tightness up in here, uh, and uh, to the point where, you know, she was even couldn't move her neck. You know, as a young woman, it's like, how does that happen? But thankfully now, how are you doing? Doing a lot better uh, now that I'm coming to see you on a regular <laughs> basis. Um, when I first started seeing you, I was super nervous because I didn't know what to expect. Um, but Dr. Bove was super kind and super gentle with me, which I was obviously super appreciative of. And um, I'm now more sedentary than I was, but I do work out regularly, which is great. And um, now I come in just for routine stuff to, to take care of everything. So I know, it's amazing. It's awesome. You know, she's, she's gone from, you know, college student to, uh, you know, out in the professional world and is, is working on getting her... Uh, personal training certificate. I mean, how, how cool is that? You know, so, thanks for tuning in. All right, hop on, facing down. Let's check that upper back, neck, the whole, everything. Definitely much better, but I, I, I can feel what you feel, too. This yeah. band of tightness all along this left shoulder blade. So we'll look to the alignment as the cause of why. Why would that muscle be acting in that way? Now, no pain when you take a deep breath? No. Good. Thank God. Beautiful. Okay. There is rotation to the right, actually, here, right here, T3, T4, and the body in its brilliance wants to correct that. It's, it, it knows exactly where everything is. It's trying to fire muscle to pull right to left, and uh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We're going to assist the body in that by pushing it right to left, and uh, yeah, it'll be amazing. Perfect. So, right here, deep breath, good, let it all the way up. Awesome. Super easy. Her body already wants that to happen, so we barely have to touch her for that to move. And that was amazing. Beautiful. We do have to work on this area, but we'll do that either standing or uh, facing up. How's your low back? Um, my hips have been a little bit sore, but generally I'm okay. Again, it might be hard to see on the camera angle, but this, this pelvis is lower than this. So there's this gentle shift, which will adjust and uh, change. And uh, yeah, that puts a little more pressure right here on these muscles. Okay, turn on your side facing me. Beautiful. Let me have this leg pushing. Oh my goodness, that was like <laughs> a symphony orchestra. Oh. All right, flip all the way over. <laughs> Perfect. Tilting down on this left side. Amazing. All right, go ahead on your back, facing up, please. Even, hips are even, feet aren't flopping in or out. That's perfect. Okay. Crisscross, just like this. Changing that angle. Hmm. 
Perfect. <laughs> you did it. Okay, now let me have these hands. Good. Near perfect, near perfect. Just a little off same, that junction between neck and upper back. I'm going to change, take that angle out. Perfect. C6, gently here. Perfect. That was amazing. All right, come on up and have a seat facing this way. I have to fix the neck. <laughs> I am the chiropractor, you know, everything has to be symmetrical. <laughs> Beautiful. Just some muscle work. Everything's uh, back in line. Oh. This is already softening up. Because it re realizes, it recognizes, it doesn't have to fire anymore. It's already fixed. All right, Erica, you are ready to rock and roll. Thanks so much for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe, Captain Crunch DC, and uh, we'll continue to make some uh, fun and uh, awesome videos. See ya.